Hey, this is Mike from Ubercool. I told you in the beginning that I generally have always been the one to <clears throat> try to show shortcuts and different things that go right and go wrong. In the past week, a lot has gone wrong with this, and these are the things that people tend to hide. Um, right now, I have a situation with a set of taillights that don't fit. Um, I have headlights that don't fit. The biggest thing I have is I have paint that won't cure. Near as we can tell, <clears throat> because I don't have a climate controlled booth, last Thursday when I shot this, that weather system came in. And there was a sudden drop in the barometer or, or barometric pressure or whatever the case may be and I've contacted the paint rep and the paint rep tells me that there is thinner trap between the clear and the paint that did not escape due to the weather system um, it was not raining when I painted it it didn't rain till that evening but evidently the atmosphere outside change. So what I have here is a car that I shot last Thursday and every time I touch it it still leaves a fingerprint. So we are going to attempt to <clears throat> run lots and lots of air over this car over the next three days and see if we can't get this to actually cure so as it stands right now um, this is one of the stumbling blocks you run into when you're trying to create custom cars and you deal with the vendor issues you deal with I've heard of this happening one time in 30 years and it's never happened to me before so shame on me um, if that was the only thing, it wouldn't be bad, but then when I started pre-assembling some of the assemblies and they didn't come together, didn't fit, um, it just made it all the more worse. So these are some of the things you don't see in a lot of your build videos. These are some of the things you don't see in a lot of build videos. So right now I'm on a track of uh, Bad Luck 3, me, nothing. And we will see. I still don't have the hood emblem from the Cromer either. It's a week overdue. So, it's not going good right now here at Ubercool. <laughs> Especially seeing as this is my wife's car. So, I just thought I'd bring you up to speed on that. This is one of those instances where I show you the good with the bad. And this is a lot of bad. This is Mike from Ubercool. Out.